In this video, you will learn how to annotate and collaborate on documents and drawings in Brava for FileNet. The first button presents functions for loading and saving markups. The Save button allows a user quick access to the markup save command nested in the previously shown markup menu. End users can activate the Print button to print their documents and drawings. The arrow button is used for selecting markup entities currently available within the open document. Users can activate the Help button to launch a searchable help database, review the program's About dialog for version information, or suggest new Brava features. This group of buttons controls the functionality of the viewer and will activate different toolbars on the left-hand side of the screen depending on the mode that is activated. On the left is a menu bar containing the markup tools available to users. Select arrow pointer, text, image, stamp, change marks, cloud, sketch, line, rectangle, and strike through. The Select button allows users to select any previous annotation. The arrow pointer allows users to draw arrows to highlight specific items on the screen. The Text button allows users to add a text markup. The Image button allows users to add an image in a markup. The Stamp button allows users to add stamps. These can be custom or pre-configured. The Change Mark button allows users to add change marks to files, including threaded discussions, reasons, and other commentary. The Cloud button allows users to draw clouds around items showing in the viewer. The Sketch button allows for freeform drawing within a markup. The Line button allows for drawing lines in a markup. The Rectangle button allows for drawing rectangles in a markup. The Strike Through button allows for the strike through of text in a document. Brava for IBM FileNet offers a robust set of tools for annotating and collaborating in documents and drawings.